my office <laughs> office but so this rug it's a uh, challenge accepted vlog because my bodyguard card and the music had challenged me for to answer a 40 question 40 questions that was given to him by three amazing um, channels as well so I have to answer the challenge so for now I'm hitting two birds with one stone so right now I am at direct manahan right there so let's just do this for me time let's do the symbol right here there's red manahan my blue ranger juliana 04 and her 54 playlist video playlist sweetie ann there that's a pante right there she will be soon monetized my little girl ishimiyaka there you go right so that's one two three four five people <laughs> i'm sponsoring or i'm supporting same time i'm doing the 40 question challenge so let's start so question number one given to me by carlin was do i like blue cheese the dressing i never had the dressing just the blue cheese itself uh she is an acquired taste and smell because you would think she's spoiled but she's not it's just the way she's aged and a little fun fact uh, blue cheese legend has it that a lazy shepherd left his lunch inside a cave uh, hence it got moldy and so it was made in Roquefort France so that's a birthplace so a little fun fact a little tidbit there but yes yeah, so I never had the dressing um, yeah, the cheese itself so as a like on, on a cheese platter type of thing okay. and coke or pepsi um i like rum and coke and i did say that i drank mountain dew when i was a little girl which is made by pepsico so um either one i suppose but Let me see here. What's the next question? In the relationship? And uh, no, I'm not. I'm single, but I'm in a relationship with my family, with the one above, and the people that are watching this right now. Those are my friends, people that are worthy of losing sleep over. So until such a time that God thinks someone is out there for me, then why not? Otherwise, I'm single. Okay, uh, what else? Let me see what's happening over there. My goodness. Um, whiskey, tequila, or vodka? I don't like hard liquor. Uh, I would say only had um, straight up would be the Havana uh, Club rum from Cuba. But if I was to drink vodka, it would be with vodka and orange juice or vodka and cranberry. Um, Okay, so hot dog or cheeseburger? Cheeseburger, for sure. Hot dog is okay, but I'm more cheeseburger. Favorite food? Uh, let's say pasta, like the pesto and the Mediterranean, and pizza, the Hawaiian pizza especially. Those are my favorites. Um, drink in the morning, of course, coffee. I have to have coffee in the morning. I drink tea. But mostly in the afternoon or at night. So, can I do 100 push ups? I wish I can, but no, I can only do up to 5 or 10, depending on how energetic I, I can be. But 100 push ups, no. Favorite season? I don't really have one per se, but I would. Uh, I love all of them. Um, you know, with the summer, you get to go out, sunbathing, go to the beach, um, 
go sightseeing anywhere you want, enjoy the weather, then the, the fall comes in, Halloween, uh, this, the vibrant colors of the leaves, and the winter with the snow, um, snowball fights, so I like all of them I would say. But if I was to really pick one, I would say fall would be my favorite one. Uh, favorite hobby. I would say the most favorite hobby would be um, would say poetry. I usually like to just write and compose. You know, just random thoughts, sort of like... Um, narrative poetry so to speak um, do I have any tattoos no I don't um, I've tried henna long long time ago back in Toronto but that was just more of a, a celebration in little India over there but otherwise no uh, do I wear glasses thankfully no I still have 2020 vision, so any phobias? Um, I don't know if you can call it a phobia, but I know that if I don't feel the bottom of the pool, um, or let's say the beach or whatever, if I don't feel the bottom, that's when I get that panic attack. I'm not that attack. I think I get scared. So maybe maybe the fact that long long time ago I almost drowned when I was a little girl. So maybe that's why, but. Yeah, so deep end, I suppose you can call it the phobia. Nicknames, uh, Bugs Bunny for my parents. Uh, Jen, 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 uh, Jenna. Favorite candy? Uh, I got a lot, but I would say I love the sour ones, you know, with the sugar coating. Um, those are my favorite ones. Like the, the, even the gummies, as for Colin's favorite the gummies, the frozen one, mine is the one with sugar coating on it, and a sour one, so, do I believe in ghosts? Um, I believe in the Holy Ghost, this is a surprise, but I know that they do exist, and for the, you know, Ghostbusters, so, but, yeah, I guess I can say I, can believe, I believe in, in, in ghosts. That's why you should never speak ill of the dead, as they say. Biggest regret? Well, we all have one. Um, who doesn't, right? I mean, the main thing, we just move on. Uh, you know, of the decision that we wish we had taken, but it changed the course of our lives somehow. But I guess there's too many to read to, to, to say. But the main thing, we're not just uh, move on continue with our lives and grab life by the horn <laughs> any piercing only two both ears that's it rain or snow I uh, would say mm, snow because I love you know just falling with snowflakes snow angels snowball fights never-ending shovel um, of course pain is also not bad you know you, you get to dance in the rain go out there and uh, take a shower <laughs> under the rain so to speak but I mean other one is relaxing for me how old am I well old enough to know the difference between right and wrong <laughs> let's just say I'm old enough <laughs> fries or onion rings fries especially poutine the one with hot gravy and cheese curd that's my favorite how many kids I got five my god nephew and my four god nieces um, but I was a foster mom years and years ago I had two of them but that was years ago uh, huh, favorite colors of course blue and purple because of my birthstone's amethyst so purple and of course the blue roses and the blue butterflies I love royal blue uh, can I sing? Mm, I try to, but I'm not good at it. If I sing, it will snow. Can I whistle? 
I guess I can't, but I know that in the Philippines they have a, a game where you put pulver on inside your mouth and you whistle and you're blowing this pulver on all over. But of course I cannot whistle the way they do in New York, hailing a cab. So, where was I born? Tansa, Cavite. Siblings, I got four. Two sisters, one little brother. Can I cook? I have kind of have no choice but learn how to cook because being on your own you have to so can I swim not so much like I said I, I I panic when I don't feel the deep end so I can only swim doggy paddle am I religious yes in a way because I'm Roman Catholic so and I do believe in the existence of God so bath or shower shower bath I would say bath because of the bubble bath and the, I love the scented candles you can you know put it all around the tub you know you have a glass of wine play some soft music it's heaven uh, city or country country because you know just to be out there in the fresh air away from the city you know the, the hustle and the bustle and traffic and the pollution and smog so I would say country because I remember a long time ago oh sorry I went to a place called Elmira Ontario which is where I had first seen horse drawn buggies, Mennonites, uh, where you know, like life was simple over there. Is, uh, at least there were cars and you know, obviously, but you know, people like I've seen ho uh, buggies, you know, and there's a bridge called Kissing Bridge, which is, I believe, I remember it was the bridge shown on the uh, a story Sleepy Hollows, you know, with Ichabod Crane, the headless horseman, that little bridge there. So, am I a good friend? Well, I'll let you decide for that <laughs> on that question. Uh, any broken bones? I don't, thankfully, no, I don't. But years ago, I injured my knee at work, so, um, and because of that, I had a contusion on my knee so which is of course uh, it's true what they said that when it rains your knee hurts so but yeah but nothing broken thankfully enough how many TVs only one because it's my WH power tool as you know worst pain does toothache count <laughs> um, but, I mean obviously you know it when you have a toothache your head hurts your neck hurts ev your, your face hurts so, it's the most uh, debilitating pain, I think, is, to, is toothache. And of course, nothing was more painful than losing a friend or a family member. So, do I like to dance? Of course I do. Uh, when I was young, in my 20s, I used to like to go clubbing with my friends. You know, we'd go out at night in downtown and go out dancing, have a drink, you know, just play pool, eat, uh, what's that, uh, is it the food, nachos, so, do I like camping, yes, I do, I, first camping experience would be Baltimore, Maryland, and Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania, where I had s'mores for the very first time, you sit there under the stars, and you just let the sound of crickets, owls hooting in the background and you and the fire crackling and someone playing a guitar or you tell go six scare stories you have a kind of you know like a, a barbecue or uh, some beer or wine or whatever and just enjoy nature and I wouldn't mind doing it again am I weird who isn't right um, yes I am actually <laughs> I'm very weird it is my weirdness and sense of humor that kept me alive that kept me afloat all those years ago when I was on my own so yes I am weird question number 40 would be to share this with six other people because I was one of the six but I couldn't possibly choose six because there's so many 
blue roses of mine and I didn't want to risk playing favorites so instead I will nominate the people that are viewing this right now if you would accept the challenge of doing the 40 challenge question and I would love to know if you and I have something in common besides YouTube because I just found out that Karin and I have quite a lot of common same way I do with Julianne Opo who she did something similar with the fun facts about her so like I said I cannot possibly choose six so instead I will nominate those that are viewing this in real time with me, this premiere, to do the 40 questions with me. And hope that you and I will have something else in common. So for now, thank you for watching this premiere. And I'm going to go back supporting my friend, Derek Manahan, Julianne Ofo. Suzy Ann, Tess Apante, Ishi Miyaka. So thank you for watching and enjoy the rest of your day, evening, where you may be. Please stay safe and remember no, no matter how much typhoon hits or how many typhoon ends up doing a landfall. Stay safe. Be kind. And be resilient. Bye guys. Thank you so much for watching. I look forward to hearing your 40 questions. Your answer to the 40 questions. Bye. Love you. Bye.